What's up, everybody? It's John from the Fitness Oracle. Um, I just wanted to thank you for uh, taking the, taking the time to take a look at uh, the the this new format of the daily shows. Um, you may have noticed that we're utilizing uh, video content a little bit more, which is uh, more on the lines of where we wanted to be with everything. Um, what I did want to ask you guys before we get started with today's show was to be able to uh, support us in our in our mission to help help with men's mental health when, as it applies to exercise and martial arts and wellness in the entire stratosphere of health and wellness. So if you know anybody who is suffering from mental health issues that are suffering from loneliness, depression, uh, anxiety, stuff like that, just share this with them. Please, please, please help us even more by subscribing to our channel uh, and uh, share and uh, hit the little bell to be notified every time that every time that we release a new episode, which which should be on a daily basis. But it's always good to be notified when we come out with with new with new content, right? So remember, just to reiterate, um, hit the subscribe button, subscribe to our channel, show us that you care, um, hit the little bell to be notified when we're releasing a new episode. And again, if you know anybody who's suffering from any form of mental health uh, issues when it comes to depression, uh, anxiety, and stuff like that, please share it with them as we can, as the entire mission of this show is to help others. Hope you enjoyed today's episode and stay healthy, my friends. What's up, everybody, and welcome to another episode of the Fitness Oracle Minicast series. I am your host, John Katsavos, and today we are wrapping up the week of the spine. And what a week it has been. Um, you guys have seen me go off on tangents. You guys have seen me go off on rants and raves, and I hope you guys have found a lot of it uh, enlightening and uh, inspiring and uh, educational because that's what I that's what I'm trying to do with these. Uh, at least give you my perspective and my point of view on these topics. Um, Monday was myths and misconceptions, and we talked about a couple of myths that uh, that go around the training industry when it comes to or the spine and like throwing in some really interesting facts like what it is how it's constructed what it does what we can do with it what we can't do with it how to tuesday we talked about uh we talked a lot about um getting into you know how do you actually train it how do you how do you make it stronger what are the what, what are the uh, what are some of the um, underlying issues what are some of the not underlying issues what are the compensat compensatory factors that can we can implement if we don't have the ability to do it uh, Wednesday we talked about uh, the, the one big question that surrounds the spine. Go back Thursday. We talked about my uh, my introduction to this whole thing, and me being able to pull myself out of you know mainstream and really looking at how do I change myself to help my clients. And that will happen when uh, I had the, the 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 guy with spina bifida. And uh, I couldn't train him in the traditional way. I had to actually go out of the traditional way to really think about, you know, how do I give him the best ability to do what he needs to do? Yesterday, we, I went off on the industry as I normally do because sometimes it irks me. I love the industry. Let's just let's just get one thing straight. I love my industry. I love it. I absolutely love it. I think it's the best industry in the world where you can take people, change their lives for the better, 
so that they can be better and they can live amazing lives. I think it's the best job in the world. I just find some of the terminologies that we use could be better. Like proprioception, like training the spine, like isolating the spine. We're not going to recap to <laughs> DJF Hot Friday, but uh, next week we are introducing the month of October. And in that month, we're going to be talking a lot about the harvest season. And because it is harvest season, it's the time of year where we bunker down, do the work and prepare for the colder months ahead, the darker months ahead. Um, darker meaning, you know, less light because the days are shorter, the nights are longer. <laughs> then it goes back. So uh, we're going to be talking about um, foods that help the sad because sad is the uh, basically we're going to be talking about sad. You know, seasonal, seasonal, what is it called? Seasonal something dip, disorder, d depression disorder, something like that. So stuff that we can do to help combat that, because there is a lot of stuff that we can do to combat it. And we can get it through our foods. We can get it through our exercise. We can get it through our communities. We can get it through um, just ourselves. Just And we're going to, and then the final month, and in the final week, we're going to get into integration. That's going to be a fun week. Even more funner. I think it's going to be more fun. I think you guys are going to really enjoy me going right off, right off on integration. It's going to be a lot of fun. Let's see. This is, this is, this is the crazy smile right here. Crazy smile. I'm riled up for it. I can't wait. I can't wait for week five. Cannot wait for it. Anyways, um, I really hope that you guys enjoy it. I really hope uh, last week, I really hope you guys got a lot of content out of it and a lot of uh, insight. Um, in two weeks, October 10th, I am launching the Seven Day King Blueprint. Um, I would be honored if you guys could, you know, be on that call if you guys need you guys just so you guys can take a look at you know what we offer here at what at, at, at via fitness uh we get into all four pillars of my of all four of my pillars of fitness which are nutrition rest and recovery exercise and mindset we cover all four aspects which gives you that, that foundation so that you can actually amplify your results when you start working out, when you start to say, when you start to say, yes, I am going to dedicate, I am going to make a positive change in my life for me so I can take control of and be in control of my health because that's the only person that has control of your health is yourself. Don't let anybody else fool you. I'm not here to fool people. I'm not here to trick people. Best part about this, I'm giving this away for free. This, these are two tips and tricks that I have picked up over the past 20 years, over 20 years. Excuse me. I'm coming up to 30 years. My mistake since 16 almost 30 years of my knowledge I'm giving away for free. So you guys would be, um, I'm not going to say uh, it would be in your best interest to take a look at it. I'm not charging anything for it. I just want you to be able to live the best version of your life for yourself. And um, it starts October 10th at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I may have to revisit that time. Don't quote, don't quote on me on that time. 
Let me just double check that. Yeah, looks like 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So uh, you don't want to miss it. You want to be a part of it. And I mean, it's for you. It's for you. Anyways, um, I really look forward to the, you know this month because this month is where we get a lot of work done as well. This is where we set ourselves up for success for the for twenty twenty two. It's and surprisingly, it's not January. It's now. It's October when we start to set our yearly plan for the next year. So get on it. Uh, message me. It was, uh, message me to get access to the private Facebook group, which where everything's going to be happening for the Seven Day King Blueprint. Seven Day King Blueprint. And if you're not in the Power Tribe and you're not like seeing the lives. Send me a message. Let me know. I'll pop you in there. I'll send you the link to to get in there, and you guys can we can rock this because there's a lot of free training that I do in there every Tuesdays. So, with that, I will let you guys go, and you guys have an amazing start to the week, and enjoy your Saturday. <laughs>